Good evening, Floyd County, Mud Creek, Hazard, Florida, many places that I, they tell me that they see me on WLJC. WLJC has been a lot to me. It's been my life. It's been my comfort. It's been my enjoyment. I love WLJC. This is good news to be able to come and be able to worship, be able to lift up the name of Jesus. And this is where it's all at. Come on down. If you need prayer, come on down. I don't care what time you walk in. Come, if you want love, come on down to WLJC. You'll get love. You'll get mercy. You'll get compassion. And that's what it's all about. I love WLJC. service tonight. We really hope you'll stay tuned. We have an excellent singing group from all the way down in Tennessee. Aha, uh -huh. guess what? I forgot my mic. I'm so new at this that, you know, just been here 30, over 31 years, so I just forgot he had to have a mic. But anyway, be sure and stay tuned because we have an excellent group of singers from all the way down in Tennessee and uh, Dottie has phone operators and so we're going to have a good uh, service tonight and feel free to call if you need to and if not just kind of kick back and enjoy the music and the service. All right, we want to share um, some scripture with you, Second Corinthians uh, fourth chapter. Therefore seeing that we uh, have this ministry as we have received mercy we faint not and have renounced the hidden things of dishonesty not walking in craftiness nor handling the word of God deceitfully but by manifestation of the truth commending ourselves to every man's conscience in the sight of God but if our God if our gospel be hid it is hid to those that are lost in whom the God of this world has blinded the minds of them which believe not, lest that the light of the glorious gospel of Christ, who is in the image of God, should shine unto them. For we preach not ourselves, but Jesus Christ the Lord, and ourselves your servants for Jesus' sake. For God, who commanded the light to shine out of darkness, hath shined in our heart to give the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Jesus Christ." And we have this assurance and we have this treasure in earthen vessels that the power of God may be seen and not of us. We are troubled on every side, yet not distressed. We're perplexed, but not in despair. Persecuted, but not forsaken. Cast down, but not destroyed. Always bearing about in the body the dying of the Lord Jesus Christ and the life also of Jesus might be made manifest in our bodies. For we which live always delivered unto death for Jesus' sake, the life also of Jesus might be made manifest in our mortal uh, flesh. So then death worketh in us, but life in you. We, we having the same spirit of faith according as it is written, I believed and therefore have I spoken. We also believe and therefore speak, knowing that he which raised up the Lord Jesus shall raise us up also by Jesus and shall present us with you. For all things are for your sakes and the abundance of grace might through the thanksgiving of many rebound to the glory of God. For which cause we faint not, but... Through, uh, though our outward man perish, yet the inward man is renewed day by day. For our light affliction, which is but for a moment, worketh for us a far more exceeding and eternal weight of glory. 
while we look not at the things which we have seen, but at the things which are not seen, for the things which are seen are temporal, and the things which are not seen are eternal. Now that's Second Corinthians, the fourth chapter, talking about if we do not share what we know about the gospel, then it is going to be hidden from those that need it the worst. And uh, that the, the God of this age has blinded their minds and their eyes. And that's why we have Christian TV, um, you know, 24-7, is for the truth to go out and for those that, that will listen and those that will uh, be exposed to the truth and to the gospel, that they can change their life and be with the Lord forever. And it says, regardless, you know, how our light afflictions, you know, all the trouble that a Christian goes through, it's not anything compared to uh, uh, what our eternal glory is going to be when, when he takes us home. And so uh, tonight, if you are feeling a little on the discouraged side, just uh, remember that the Lord is working everything good uh, to our good uh, in his eternal glory. All right, just before we pray, we have uh, some prayer requests from West Virginia. Ida has called, uh, and for herself and her son Larry, he has uh, a problem there. A lady has called for a Mary. Uh, she's in Corbin's, had uh, three strokes and an aneurysm. Her husband just got out of the hospital. Prayer for both of them. And John Amos, he's had a heart attack, 90% of... Uh, his heart uh, the, is blocked. He had, is having surgery on Tuesday. Their grandson, Gary Daniel, is only 19 years old and having his third open heart surgery. And also Nick Baker's family. Here's a lady that's called her kidneys are failing. Uh, Tina, she is saved, but she feels like she's pulling away from God. Here's a mother that is called and said her Daughter is on cocaine really bad. Her husband has put her out of the house. Uh, let's see. Uh, this one is from Johnson County for a 12-year-old that has been in a four-wheeler accident and is in the hospital, and also for Tammy that is now with hospice uh, with cancer. And then we just learned uh, of the death of Wendell Napier from Manchester in... Uh, that happened today and the funeral arrangements of course are incomplete at this time but the family needs prayer and that's what we're going to do right now father in the name of jesus we come to you we thank you for the scripture we thank you for the admonition that it gives us to share the gospel every chance we we have so that more people can come out of darkness and, and into the light. And you are the light, Lord Jesus. You are everything that we will need or will ever think about needing. So, Father, in Jesus' name, we ask you for your mercy and your blessings on this service. We ask you to bless and anoint our singers and reward them for their effort for being here tonight. Bless our audience and the phone operators. And, Lord, let us all do our very best. Uh, for you tonight, and then we'll then we'll be glad when this is all over. In Jesus' name, Amen. All right, we're really happy tonight to have with us um, uh, a group. Uh, let's see. I guess this is second or third time you've been here. Okay, uh, the Heavenly Heirs, and they're from Tazewell, Tennessee. And, of course, they have CDs. That's what I'm holding up here. Sometimes I forget and leave them on the table. But they do have them, and uh, you will enjoy them. The phone number is 423-526-1917. And they're from the Eagles Rock Missionary Baptist Church. And so right now, let's welcome the Heavenly Heirs. Let's 
back for God to always know that on me He can depend. He's always been there for me when it seemed I'd He's an enemy of our Lord. Just let me be a friend to my Lord. Cause he's been one to me. What would I do? And where would I go? made it possible for us to be out tonight and just ask you tonight whatever trial you're going through whatever tribulation whatever trouble we serve an awesome God that is far beyond able to do anything that we could think or ask so tonight whatever the need may be just call call on his name give it to him if you're in need of salvation that's the one thing that it takes to get from earth to glory we've got to be covered by the blood I tell you what, a cry from a beggar will make a child of the king.
Child of the King. A cry from a beggar made a child of the King. And one who had nothing now has everything in love and compassion. on my 
Savior, I could no longer see the storm. He stepped out on the child of the king no matter what trials troubles you're going to face that everything's going to be fine and everything will be okay amen Okay, I just had 
had a talk with Jesus. He said help is on the way. So just hang on.
fire walking around and the three little Hebrew children oh he brought safely out and sometimes I have to walk through the fire just to see Oh, 
many ways I have been blessed All I can say is God has been good Sometimes the night brought sorrow and pain and Sometimes the tears fell like the rain Oh, but through it all, you know He's never changed God is still good Thank you so much. The Heavenly Heirs from Tazewell, Tennessee. And I want to remind you, they do have uh, uh, three CDs. And uh, I'm not sure. I haven't talked to them about how much scheduling they do. But I'm sure they'll go when time permits, right? <clears throat> All right. And to get in touch with them now, call 423-526-1917 or... Um, Write to them at the Heavenly Heirs, Post Office Box 987, Tazewell, Tennessee, 37879. And they'll be glad to hear from you. Now, you would like to have those CDs in your home because this is some great singing you're listening to tonight. And uh, if you would like to have them come your way, well, call them at that number. And uh, like I say, I haven't really talked to them, but... All they could do is tell you no. So, <laughs> but they'd probably say they would come if the, if time permits. You know, when you have to work for a living, uh, you know, it makes it a little harder to fit in all these extras. But we appreciate them coming uh, all the way up here tonight to be with us. And uh, so now, just remember their phone number and call them if if uh, you would like to for them to come your way. And uh, they're from the. Um, Eagle, Eagles Rock Missionary Baptist Church, and that's that's good. So they're on a mission trip up here tonight. Get the gospel out in song. All right, I believe uh, we've uh, we've let them have a minute or two. Is that enough break, or do you have to have more? <laughs> they're okay. All right. Well, let's just go right back. While let them sing as much as they can, because it's a while since we can get them back, and so. Uh, but you pray for them and enjoy this music. The, uh, the heavenly, heavenly airs from Tazewell, Tennessee. You know, there's operators on standby tonight for whatever the need is in your life. And Jesus Christ will be the greatest need that you'll ever have. He's able to go with you all the way, even unto the end. I'm glad tonight. He is all I need. Amen. I don't need silver. I don't need gold. I don't need 
satisfy my soul. takes care of me and he's all I need when my time has come I'll cross that river when my life here is done I fought the battle the victory's been won he's all I Tear the roof off. 
Sometimes he gives us peace through the storm, but the point being, he'll always give you peace no matter what. All you got to do is trust and lean on him. Never have no fear. Amen.
how great it would be Have his footsteps in mind And walk with the Master All of the time And when trials come They seem so nigh I'll run to the Master I know he'll get there sickness comes and this body's in pain all I have to do is just call on his name and why should I worry why should I fear when this very same Jesus he is always so near he lives in my
God's Son rise out of Judah? Did he walk up Golgotha? The past holds the power of his promise to me. I just go.
one who lives in me. I found every promise that he ever made me. Jesus will keep. He's walked by my side in deserts dry. Loved me and held me when I cried. So let me sing you one more song in case I live. And I know how I made it. I made it by God. Steps that are slower now. trembling voice once more. I know how I made it. I know how I made it. I made it by God's grace. Now God's children are leaving here one by one. They're passing this way and they're going home. The signs of the time reveal we don't have very long. Stands upon that shore, waving goodbye as they rejoice. Well, glory to God, we'll leave here singing that same victory song. Cause I know how I made it. Thank you so much, uh, the Heavenly Heirs from Haswell, Tennessee. Uh, and if you want to write to them, Post Office Box 987, Taswell, Tennessee, 37879. They do have CDs for sale. If you want to just call them, uh, that'll be all the, the singing that we have tonight. But I want you to know that you can order their CDs. You can keep them at home. They And... Uh, play them every day, every night. And uh, the phone number is 423-526-1917. We appreciate them coming. I, I'm sure that some of the songs they did tonight are on these tapes, right? All right, but the, all the songs have really been good. They're uplifting and very big blessing. We appreciate the group for Heavenly Airs from, for coming uh, this far. Would some of you like to come up and help pray for the prayer request? And uh, we, always, uh, we always like uh, prayers of agreement. Well, from Jellicoe, Tennessee, uh, there's some folk really enjoying the music tonight, and they're pledging $25 to WLJC tonight because of the singers. From uh, London, some more folk are uh, getting a blessing from the singing. We have a number of prayer requests, uh, but here is a good praise report. Uh, Sarah from Lincoln County has called and said that uh, she's heard from her son for the first time in a long, long time, and he's off of drugs now, and uh, he's been off for one year, and he called to wish her happy birthday. So that was a really a, a great praise report. I can see how that mom would be happy with that. And that's great that the son got delivered. Uh, Mildred is under hospice care with, uh, at stage four cancer and needs the Lord. A wife has called for her husband. 
He had surgery, then had a massive heart attack and praying for God's mercy and healing. Jesse from Johnson County, lost family members will be saved. Uh, from Madison County, a daughter uh, that is uh, having some complications from uh, the medication uh, that she's taking and she needs help there. Juanita Smith is going to be going to uh, Lexington for some tests and so forth. And then also remember the family of Wendell Napier that passed away today from uh, Clay County. Uh, a mother from Shepherdsville has breast cancer and bone cancer and needs, needs prayer. Uh, there's, uh, this one is urgent. From um, Corbin, the doctors have given, uh, for a daughter that's in Michigan, the doctors have not given the family much hope. She's in a coma. But the caller is believing God for complete healing. From Clay County, a lady is having chest pains and, and she's depressed. Uh, her daughter refuses to talk to her. So she needs emotional as well as physical healing. Uh, the Gooch family from Danville, a niece, uh, had surgery and the doctors are still not sure what uh, the problem is, but she needs a good report. Mrs. Loudon, she's a, she's a faithful little viewer. She calls, I think, every night and she's all time, she wants us to pray tonight now that she'll have a good night of sleep. Sometimes she'll say she's waiting for Dr. Jesus to come by. <laughs> and so it's, it's always sweet to hear from these people that depends on this as their church. Mm -hmm. And you know, when that happens, well, um, all right. And you know, uh, this request is for all the folk that lost their jobs in the mines this last week. They was what, like 500 of them, um, a large number. And uh, uh, you, you wonder how are those people going to make it, but God has ways of sustaining us. All right, from Corbin, fourth stage cancer needs a special touch from the Lord. Uh, a son has uh, had a heart attack and had stents put in, and then her husband passed away, and the wife lives alone. From Somerset, several health problems, and from Cynthiana, someone in the hospital needs help. All right, uh, we'll not be able to get to near all of them, but we're we're going to talk a little bit a minute here to this group and let them tell you uh, anything else. Uh, I didn't have much information tell on to tell about you, so I uh, so what do you uh, all of you work? I suppose okay. And so, uh, how many weekends a month do you uh, uh, do you I travel every weekend? Oh, you travel every weekend. Yeah. Do you get a mic? You got a mic. Kind of oh. weekend warriors, I guess you'd say. Oh, okay. Well, well, now that that takes some that takes dedication because if you work all week, you're tired. You're ready for a weekend of rest. But they're they're doing missionary work, and so that is that is great. Um, so, about so if people call you at this number, is that the one you schedule yeah, from? It's the scheduled number. You, you want to give it? <laughs> to be honest with you, I don't know it. It's David's number. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, you know, I've been known to give somebody else's number up here, so I'll... 423-526-1970. Uh, so, um, and that, that will get you in touch with them and the heavenly heirs, and they will uh, consider coming your way when, when the weekend rolls around that they can. But... Uh, uh, are you working on any more CDs right now? Or are you We're just currently praying about it, and we just ask everyone to help us pray about it, that God lead and guide and direct, and okay. when He takes care of it, we'll know it'll be, be time. All right. Anything special you want to tell the folk about the... Have you written any of these songs? Or? No, we didn't write any of those songs, but we've had good friends that come along, and they'll give us songs that they have written, so some of those are originals. Mm -hmm. yeah, notice this one by... Uh, Mike Payne, uh, he's yes. been here. Uh, Mike's a great singer and songwriter. Uh, Angel Step Back. We definitely enjoy that one. Yeah, that, well, those, those are good. I'm sure, I am sure all the songs are good. So, well, all right, we're going to ask these, uh, these folk to uh, take this and take the oil there and anoint them and lead us, lead us in prayer. And uh, we're going to agree with them and... If you've called, well, you, your faith is already 
on receiving an answer. So anything y'all want to say before, go ahead. Go ahead. Gracious Father, we come before your presence tonight. Lord, first off, we've got to thank you for a wonderful time together tonight, for a wonderful spirit that met us here. And Lord, that even in this place tonight where there may not be many, Father, we know that your spirit is real and we know that it has went out tonight and it's found a lodging place in the hearts of those that needed it. And God, we thank you for that assurance tonight. Father, we thank you for our salvation and knowing beyond a shadow of a doubt, Lord, that we're saved by you. Lord, we pray on behalf of these requests tonight. Lord, as we go from this place, we're liable to forget these names. And Father, we may even forget some of the situations, but God, you know every heart. Lord, you know every situation, you know every circumstance that every person is in tonight. And Lord, the greatest part is, is that you can be with every single one of them at the same time. And God, I pray tonight that your will would be done in each one of those situations. But Father, I pray also that you'd grant strength to those people that are involved. God, that their faith would grow strong in you and they would look to you. And God, realize that though we may not always understand, Father, your will is perfect. And Father, you have no mistakes and you've never made a mistake and you never will. But God, most of all tonight, we pray for those that have a spiritual need, those that are lost, that don't know you. Yes. Lord, that you'd convict their heart and Lord, show them their need of salvation. And Father, not just the flames of hell, but Lord, show them your love. Amen. Lord, that your love went beyond our faults. And Lord, it went beyond all that we could ever do. And Father, it gave your only son to die for us. And Lord, tonight as they sang, we claim that blood. And Father, we claim it over these prayer requests tonight that you'll move in each heart. God bless this TV station and all its efforts and its mission work that it does. Lord, that you'd richly bless them in all avenues. Go with us, we pray. And Father, we're careful tonight to pray in the precious name of Jesus Christ. And amen. 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 Well, thank you very much. And um, so, uh, uh, once again, let's give you uh, these numbers here. And... Uh, so you can get in touch with this group because I'm sure they would be a blessing to uh, come your way. The Heavenly Heirs, Post Office Box 987, Tazewell, Tennessee, 37879. And then the phone number is 423-526-1917. And we do really appreciate uh, them coming all this way to uh, paying their own gas uh, bill and everything, hamburgers and whatever else they eat. They, they, but see, that is, uh, you know, uh, we do our best to help, help them to, uh, uh, n for people to get to know you and to uh, give you, let uh, people know who you are and, and to sell your tapes. That's why we, we keep mentioning that because when you buy their tapes, then they can buy more gas and eat more hamburger right. and go to, <laughs> or whatever you eat. So, uh, but anyway, we appreciate you uh, coming. Anything, anything? Like thank you that you gave us an opportunity oh. to be here to witness to people through song. And we just want to give him honor and glory for it all, for he's surely worthy to be praised. Yes. And we know and realize that without him tonight, well, we're nothing, but with him, we can be everything. Yes. All right, that's so true. Well, we appreciate the good, humble spirit that these folk have come in. Talented people, very much so, but very dedicated. That's what I like. And, uh, and I'm sure that that blesses the Lord. When, he, when we put Him first, well, then He is first, yes. and that's the way it should be. Well, we're out of time, so from all of us here in the studio, we want to say good night, and God bless you.